percent skill, fifteen percent concentrated power of will, five percent pleasure, fifty percent pain, and a hundred percent reason to remember the name. Hey guys, it's Wednesday on the Rebels, and I'm Amber Sweeney. And this week we're doing a yearly roundup, um, covering kind of all of our highs and lows of the past year. Um, I don't have any lows. What is wrong with you? I had a really good year. Um, that sounds really bitchy, doesn't it? Kind of fits my personality. Anyway, um, the year started off with my blog. Um, it was originally called the 104 in 365. And once I realized people were reading it and checking it out, I gave the blog a facelift and a new name to what you know it as now as me, my shelf, and I.com. And then everything just sort of um, took off from there. I got to meet a lot of really cool authors through uh, meet and greets. People like Courtney Allison Moulton, Claudia Gray, Lee Clifford. Um, Kimberly Durding, Kendra Blake, to name a few. I got the amazing opportunity to help Leah design and make some t-shirts for about her book, A Touch Mortal, and uh, make a cafe press store for that, so that was a lot of fun. And then through that, she told me I should try out for the Rebels, um, which I did, and obviously I made it because I'm here still. Pam fired me. God. Uh, that some of my blogs have been pretty questionable, so um, that pink slip shows up. I'm going to understand why. I also got to have dinner with uh, with the amazing Tessa Groton and her pals Maggie Stiebotter and Brenna Yanaboff. They were in town here in Minnesota for something, and they came to one of my book club meetings, which is which is crazy. It was very strange. Um, I, it was it was great having them, but just to know that I was sitting there having having dinner with these amazing people. Um, it was really cool. What else did I get to do this year? I'm writing. Of course, I'm writing writing a book. I'm writing two books, actually. Um, well, one I've sort of shoved off to the side, and now I'm focusing on my, um, my contemporary novel. It's going slowly. The first of the year, I'm going to be putting full force and effort into it. I kind of had to figure some stuff out with the blog because it's my baby, but it takes up a lot of my time. All right. Um, I got this new furniture this year. It's squeaky. It's great. Let's see what else I've read to date. As of today, I have read 117 books this year. I'm surprised my eyes have not packed up and just took off because seriously, I look at my bookshelves right now and I'm kind of going, oh God, I couldn't read another book if you made me. But then all these new novels come out and they look great and then I get people asking me to read their books and then I've got emails from publishers asking me to read stuff. So. I sort of feel obligated and I'm trying to step back from that so I can focus on writing more next year. It was a great year and uh, and I have you guys to thank for that actually because uh, obviously you guys are watching these videos and um, popping onto my blog and by the way speaking of the blog, shameless plug here guys, but it is Wednesday so it's okay. Um, blog anniversary extravaganza going on right now on the blog, a giveaway every single day until I run out of stuff to give away. We're up to today's day six and we're giving away Possess by Gretchen McNeil. Awesome. Okay. And um, I have giveaways scheduled until so far the 1st of January. So go to the blog, click the button, enter them all, and um, see you guys next year. Happy holidays. It's cold outside. This evening has been, been hoping that you